Chris, for that huge change that's on the way. Uh, an unusual summer snowstorm on the way. It arrives late tonight and will be here all day tomorrow. I want to start with the current, and we are uh, worried about our air quality. Often we say it's unhealthy for sensitive groups, meaning if you have a compromised immune system, for instance, uh, today it's unhealthy for all. So anyone here along the urban corridor, uh, take it easy outside. Our air is really filled with smoke and other pollutants. We are also worried about fire danger. All of the red counties here, red flag warning through this afternoon. Uh, gusty winds, of course, hot and dry conditions. Things finally change, though, overnight tonight. 30s and 40s in the high country, 50s on the western slope this morning, mostly 50s and 60s on our eastern plains. It is 47 in Lyman, 59 at the airport, 43 in Steamboat Springs, 50 from Chris Doherty, our weather watcher south of Evergreen. She's reporting heavy smoke in the area. So this is the story. It's off to the north. It is a very powerful cold front. It comes in after sunset tonight behind it unusually cold. In fact, record cold air for the next couple of days is what we are thinking. Future casts were sunny today with haze and smoke in the air. Clouds will increase around or after sunset tonight, and then that front will blast in here by midnight. Rain quickly develops behind it by sunrise tomorrow. It will be mixing with or changing to snow. And then we have a chance for snow pretty much uh, statewide throughout the day on Tuesday with some rain showers in the lowest elevations on the western slope and eastern plains. A variety of freeze alerts in effect, mainly for Tuesday night into Wednesday. A hard freeze expected for many areas. The growing season is very likely going to end. Winter storm warnings in the pink, advisories in the purple. Our foothills under a warning. The metro area, Denver through Fort Collins and Greeley, under a winter weather advisory. This will all start tonight into your Tuesday. Here's the snow forecast. Take a look. Heavy snow in the mountains, 8 to 14 inches possible. Central and southwest mountains, 8 to 12 in the front range and our higher foothills. Lighter totals on the eastern plains and western slope. In the metro area, as usual, a very sharp line along I-25. Lighter totals to the east, heavier totals to the west. We will see a lot of melting, but we will also see compaction because this snow will be heavy and wet. It will not take very much to create issues for our our trees because they are still full of leaves. 70s and 80s today in the high country, 90s eastern plains and western slope. There's the change for tomorrow. We will not make it, make it out of the 30s during the day on Tuesday here in Denver. There's the five day forecast. Considering it was 101 on Saturday, we're talking a 70 plus degree drop by the time we get to Tuesday night, early Wednesday. Dominic will have some snow. I think for the most part in the city, the roads will just, just be wet and slushy. Uh, but, you know, nonetheless, this is a shocker to the system. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah, to say the least. All right, Chris, thanks so much.